of you beautiful people out there. My name is Majestic Muffin and welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I already started doing things. I outlined where I wanted to put scratches. Why? Why do I want to do this to my face and why am I wearing overalls and a striped shirt? Maybe because I want to turn myself into Chucky today. I don't have a long sleeve striped shirt. Striped shirt. This is all you get. This is what you have. Um, this may come as a surprise to those who know me because I absolutely hate dolls with a burning passion. I They scare me, I don't like them, and so the fact that I'm doing this is kind of ironic. Um, but a little backstory on me. I never watched the Chucky movies. I've heard a lot about them. I think I might actually watch them just because it's been so long. It's been 21 years now and I should probably watch them, I'm thinking. So I think I saw my parents watching it a little bit when I was younger. I think I saw Chucky chasing after a kid with a knife. That probably doesn't narrow anything down, but yeah. Um, so I, lo I don't, I knew what he looked like, kind of. I knew he was ginger. I'm not ginger. I'm not about to change my hair for this. And I knew he had like scratches in his face. Um, some of them are like staples and some of them are like sewed so I have thread here that I'm going to painstakingly glue onto my face using spirit gum. I would have liked to use Prozade but I don't have any so we're gonna have to use spirit gum. Um and I was as I was looking at him I realized that the majority of his um cuts scars whatever you want to call them weren't like open wounds um so that'll just be some fun coloration that I'll have to do. There in some of the pictures that I saw um, you could, there were op open wounds, I guess, but instead of skin, it was metal. Um, I don't have a, like, a silver. I have a gray. We're gonna see how that works out. I'll probably combine that, like, with white and then see. Because, like, um, in these, the spots and, like, some down here. So, yeah. I'm gonna be doing that today. And you're gonna see it. Yeah, I guess I'll just get started on it. <laughs> Again. I'm doing this off based off the pictures that I've seen. Um, so the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take my guess, right? I'm going to take my Ben Nye bruise and abrasions color wheel. That's a big surprise. And if you guys watch the happy birthday strangled tutorial type thing, you'll know where I'm going with this eye thing. So um, in the pictures that I saw, his eyes looked like purplish, pinkish type thing. Very like sad, very distraught. So I'm gonna do that lightly on this eye and then more like aggressive on this eye because it looks like it's like cut. I don't know how to explain that. I don't know how he got these scars. I hope he's okay. I know he kills people, but may I don't know. Maybe he has like a backstory in these movies that I'm not aware of. Maybe he's actually a good person and maybe killing is just therapeutic for him i don't know so be okay so i'm going to <laughs> i'm going to start now i put the my purple on the top and bottom lid and i'm just going to spread it out with my hand Like so. Um, and I'm going to do it on my right lid, like I said, just a little bit more, more, just a little bit more extra. And then I'll clean it up later. Like that. <laughs> Oh, don't I look hot? Um, okay, so there's that. Okay, I'm gonna have to look at my picture again, so I'll need my phone. I'm back. So I looked at the pictures, and so basically in all the places except the places where like the skin is pulled back, um, I'm gonna take my bruise and abrasions color wheel, and then I'm going to use the red and just basically put that on the lines that I have um, and then kind of fan it out with my pinky. Not too far. And then it'll be time for adding these. Um, maybe. 
Yes. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Also, I found out I can do time lapse on my phone. I'm going to try that right now. Okay. <laughs> That's about as good as it's going to get for now. Um, I think now I'm going to add... Oh, I can see scar wax in the places where there needs to be scar wax i know i don't really like messing with scar wax either this is me thinking i could just like probably like use my makeup color skills i don't have many of those instead of just because it's not big places it's just right here right here and over here which is hidden by my glasses but um I'll think about that. I'll get right back to you. Okay. Um, so I decided not going to use scar wax today. We're just going to solely rely on my skills that I don't have. Um, so, <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't close this. Like, it's not closing. I did it. Um, I am going to go in with my, my yarn just fell on my lap mare on makeup thingy so as you can see i only have like and i have another one of these palettes um but that's even farther away from gray <laughs> um or like silver or something so i'm gonna try to like put down gray and then like try to put a little bit of white over it and see if like that'll work um i don't know how colors work so we'll see what happens <laughs> So I'm back. This is what it looks like. It looks pretty silver to me. I mean, it doesn't look half bad. Um, I cut up my thread, whatever that's called, um, into a lot of itty bitty tiny pieces. I'll probably have to do more of what this would look like. Um, and now I'm going to go through the amazing process of putting them on my face. So... I'm going to be using, I would use Prosaid. I don't have Prosaid, so I'll be using Spirit Gum. So this is just going to take forever. I'm going to put them in the spots where I need to put them. I'll time lapse it just so you guys can still see it. Um, oh, I was like, what's making noise? It was this dragging out of the background chair. Um, okay, have fun watching me do this, I guess. I'm probably not going to record all of it. Um, and then about halfway through... We have to put some staples right here and up there next to the, uh, next to the silver areas. Okay, I'll time lapse for you. <laughs> so, I may or may not have forgotten to do the rest of that time lapse. Um, this is what she looks like. I added some more purple over here. Um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to darken the cuts and then in the big the big ones like this and like over here I'm gonna like paint it with blood you know what I mean you'll see you'll see this is tickling my chin okay I'll time lapse this for real this time So now I'm going to be doing some detailing with blurred, um, because I feel like the red isn't deep enough, um, especially for like the bigger cuts, like the middle, and then I'll probably do some detailing over here. Um, I'll be using dark blood. Uh, yeah, and I'll time lapse that and then we'll be done. And that's it. That is the look. I added some little lipstick. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about it. It's my first time any like doing like makeup makeup stuff like this. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'll have pictures going up on my Instagram in the description down below. Go follow me. 
Jeez. And then um, there's going to be a mini tutorial going up on my TikTok about this. Go follow my TikTok. Jeez. Um, yeah. And now I'm probably going to go order some Chinese food. <laughs> I hope you guys like this tutorial. It won't be very long. Um, maybe I'll redo this again in the future. I don't know. I, I don't know how to feel about it. Um, okay. Before this all comes off, like if you liked it, subscribe if you feel like it. I will see all of you beautiful people in the next video. Bye!